welcome back to Learning to Be Prepared. My name is Jeremy and today I have a, just another DIY or do-it-yourself tip. Um, this can go for your EDC bag, your bug out bag, um, your get home bag, whatever you might want to use it for. A lot of us like to use salt and pepper um, to season our food and um, when we go to carry around these full-size things of salt and pepper, the tops of them get really dirty and they can be kind of bulky to throw in your pack. So the tip that I have for you today is a way to keep your backpack um, a little cleaner by not getting salt and pepper um, everywhere. Um, saves a little bit of space and keeps things organized. So there's a couple items that you need. Um, one, we're going back to the little craft size baggies that I like to get from Walmart. Uh, the larger ones run about two dollars for a pack of hundred and the smaller ones are usually about a dollar for a pack of hundred. Now they have three or four different sizes of these baggies. My favorite ones are the one and a half by two and then the next thing you'll want to just go get is a bag of salt of individually wrapped and also uh, individually wrapped peppers. Now I get both the salt and the pepper I get both of these at Smart and Final, which is one of the stores out here. It's a kind of like a warehouse store, but there's no membership for it. And so I bought both bags for approximately $3 and maybe 50 cents for both of these. And what I do is I simply like to take the one and a half by two inch size craft, craft size baggies. And you can see how thin that is, but believe it or not, there's about um, 10 or 12 packs of salt and 10 or 12 packs of pepper inside this tiny little thing. And it makes it very, like I said, very clean and very organized. So you can just take it, drop it inside your EDC bag in a small organized pocket. And if you have one of the Eagle Creek size organizers to keep snacks in like what I do, you can drop it right in there. But personally, I use this for when I go to my EDC bag because a lot of times I go to a fast food and they forget to give me salt and pepper. Now, if you don't want to be as organized as um, I try to be on these and have it nice and neat and a very small one, you can always um, take a couple of different baggies and just throw salt in one and pepper in the other. And you know, it's still very small, um, especially even compared to just one thing of pepper, let alone carrying one of each of the salt and pepper shakers. Another thing that you can do is you can also just take one larger baggie and just fill it full of um, either salt or pepper or even both if you won't and just stick that in there. I do think that this can vary between users depending on how much salt and pepper you want to use and if you're on a camping trip you know you might want to use a lot more salt and pepper than what I would when I'm carrying my EDC bag. Now the last thing I want to show you um, <laughs> I kind of joke about this but if you just really want to be absolutely efficient about everything you're doing and you're out camping and you're on a, um, a trail that you want to make sure you don't leave stuff behind, one thing you can do is if you happen to have a little bit of Vaseline, and I know this is quite large, but you know sometimes you get those real small ones that um, for like 99 cents you just throw them in your pack and you use that petroleum jelly for your tender to help keep fires or get fires started a little bit easier. I'll just show you one thing you can do. Um, after you use your salt and pepper um, and to make sure you don't leave, literally leave anything behind, uh, I just tear the top off of mine that way the, I don't have a second little piece going around. But what I do is I just crumble it up and you betcha I just take a little bit of the petroleum jelly and um, believe it or not, you'd be surprised how you can get a little bit of fire tinder out of this. So, um, show you how. See that little thing burning? That thing is still burning. And it will burn for several seconds actually. So if you need a little bit of free tinder, um, throw a little bit of Vaseline on there and there you go. Alright guys, well, <laughs> uh, I hope you enjoyed this quick little tip and have a great day.